Greg, congratulations. What an effort from the boys. How is the mood in the changing room after that one? Yeah, um, we're really, really happy. It was um, a fighting performance. We uh, were bit under the cost last half an hour or so. So um, now nah, the boys dug deep and managed to get a big three points. Obviously it wasn't the, the best of starts going behind after three minutes, but so often this season we've seen it from the players that you know how to, to fight back when you're faced with adversity and that's exactly what you showed again. No, um, the day we did, um, they started well within the game and uh, we just had to try and get a bit of composure within the game. We've got experienced boys out there and it's uh, a big moment from Tom to get the equaliser and then we managed to uh, control a, a good bit of the game after that. Mm. What is it about this team that just never knows how to die down, how to back down? I don't know, the gaffers instilled a really strong mentality within the group. Um, we've, we've worked tirelessly, we've not looked for excuses throughout and we didn't again today, we went 1-0 down but uh, we just dug deep and we managed to dig out what we needed and that was a big three points. Getting that second goal as well, just before half time, one of your defensive partners, Cameron Carter Vickers, getting the goal as well. That must have just been the, the perfect moment to, to go into the lead. Yeah, at half -time. exactly. And I think he got man of the match, so we even managed to get a smile out in the end, which is rare for a big uh, CCV. So, no, um, brilliant for him. Uh, but it, again, everyone, it was uh, everyone that came on. I think we made five subs, so, like everyone involved. The, the gaffer's big on even the training. Um, they push the levels to make sure the boys can do it at the weekend, and that, that it's, a whole, it's a whole collective, and we're, uh, we're Really happy because on an individual basis there were so many top performances yourself included but it's that collective spirit and that collective of throwing your bodies in the line in the second half to ensure that nothing gets past Joe Hart. Yeah exactly um, that's what we touched on it wasn't just the defenders it's you've got the midfielders dropping down Dizan, Jacko working tirelessly, Leo comes on so no it was a it was generally a full team performance and uh, I think everyone in there can be happy with their efforts. Yeah but overall you know still six games left to play it's still so much football left to play as well, so obviously focus will just turn to exactly. next week. That's, um, that's at the end of the day, it is only three points, of course it was a big one, but we, um, it means nothing if we don't go and continue that form in the next week, so that'll be our aim to go and get uh, three points against St Johnson next week.